My palms may not be sweaty. My knees may not be weak. And my arms may not be heavy. But I'm not sure if, if that's vomit on my sweater already. And if it is, is it mom's spaghetti? I'm sorry. Anyway, hi guys. Head you here with some more Danganronpa. I really gotta look over what I recorded in the last episode. I really gotta look that over. I really haven't looked that over. Hi, Sayaka. What's up? <laughs> or walk, Makoto? Yes. Yes, I am. I wouldn't mind if you invited me along. <laughs> okay, fine. Yeah, that's spend some time. So it's Sayaka. Sayaka. Let's go for a walk. I think it'll help cheer us both up. Yeah, sure. Let's go for a walk. A long, leisurely walk. Cause it, cause it is daytime. And Sayaka and I grew a little closer. Now we're like, we're like bestest of buddies. We're adorable together. We're so adorable that it's now nighttime. What you gotta say? Monokum, is, is it your usual? Hmm. <clears throat> a school announcement. It is now 10 p.m. As such, it is officially night time. Soon the doors to the dining hall will be locked, and entry at that point is strictly prohibited. Okay then, sweet dreams everyone. Good night, sleep tight, don't let the bed bugs bite. The third day here has already come to an end. When will I? No, we. When are we gonna get out of here? It's a good question. Like, I feel like I've made no progress. I laid on my bed and stared blankly at the ceiling. And before I knew it, I've fallen into an uneasy sleep. I feel like we've made no progress in three days. I'm going to my theater. Hi, yo. I need an immediate fast-acting pick-me-up. Oh, really? If it doesn't act now, it's the same as giving in the regret. What do you think guides the world? Speed, of course. That's why Formula One drivers are also... Ugh. That's why Formula One drivers are so popular. Any idiot can accomplish something if they take it slow. Even a human piece of excrement can create a masterpiece if they spent their life on, their life on it. For the, all these times you were saying the the game was saying the word shit, you think they put the word shit right there instead of excrement? Monokuma, you are not refined. Someone who does things in a timely fashion is both wise and admirable. I mean that's racing in a nutshell. Straight is better than a curve or an angle. Freestyle is better than a backstroke or breaststroke. Okay. Drive through is better than a sit down. Debatable. A Sunday comic artist is better, smarter than a graphic novelist. Also debatable. What I'm saying is, speed is the gold standard of the standard world. Not really. Which is why I said why I, I need said that pick-me-up. Pick Meanwhile, 0 0.000002 seconds later. What? And, what? Is it morning already? Good morning, everyone! It is now 7 a.m., and nighttime is officially over! Time to rise and shine! Get ready to greet another beautiful day! I woke up to the irritating sound of Monokuma's voice. I slowly pulled myself out of bed. Ugh. Another night of restless sleep. Day after day, I could feel the fatigue piling up. As soon as the thought had crossed my mind. Ding dong. Wait, what? Wait, what do you mean ding dong? What? The sound of the doorbell forced its way into my room. Hey, wait, huh? Does that mean I gotta go to my door? What's up? Hey! Oh, Taco, what? A fantastic morning, isn't it? Uh, hi, yes. Sure. Taco? Hmm. Now then... You'll pardon the interruption. Not waiting for a reply, talk about Sir, I'm gonna have to ask you to not. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> What's up? Why are you in here? What's up? No matter how intensely the stormy seas may batter me, I will not fall as long as my feet are firmly planted. 
You agree, right? Yeah, sure. Not, I'm not sure I understand. No, I don't understand at all. Without a doubt. And if you can't do it alone, just find someone to support you. And you can support them back. Taco, what are you talking about? You hear me? That's how you can overcome any storm. What? Dude, why did you come in my room and tell me this? I was thinking about it last night, and I decided we all need to come really come together. What? And that was when I realized every morning from now on, after the morning announcement, everyone should have breakfast together. Sure. Okay. Quiet down and listen! And now at the beginning of that fateful day, please head to the dining hall at your earliest convenience. Why are you yelling at me, sir? Got it! That's all for now. I have to go let everyone else know the good news. Sure. Taco didn't even wait for a reply. He turned and left before I could say a thing. Uh, sure, let's head to the dining hall. Let's make this quick. We gotta make progress. We've absolutely made zero progress so far in 10 episodes. Why are you here, uh, Toko? Uh, Freaking. Uh, of course, she's got that look on her face. Toko, what's up? Uh, she's not saying anything. Um, Toko? What's your what? problem? Oh, I was just wondering what you were doing here. You should probably head to the dining hall, right? Yeah, you should. <laughs> I, I know. I just need to prepare myself mentally. Yeah, sure. Prepare herself? What is she talking about? Hmm. <laughs> I'm so ner Why are you smiling? What's she nervous about? Why are you smiling, ma'am? Uh, let me head to the dining hall and check things out. Uh, part of me doesn't feel too comfortable about this. Alright. Okay, let's let's count here. This part of me feels like there's something missing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Uh, why is Junko over there so stretched? Ma'am, why are you so stretched? Who am I talking to first off? Let's go let's go left to right and see what we can get. What's okay, your what's the problem? Point of talking to me. It's a good question. I don't know. Okay, so Taka. Let me talk to Taka. Gotcha. Let's talk to Listen Taka. Listen to me! Okay, looks like everyone's here. So then let's begin our very first breakfast meeting. Why do we need a breakfast meeting? We had a lunch meeting. Quiet down and listen! Everyone, thank you for making time in your busy schedules to come together. Give me a break. I didn't make time for shit. You try See, Leon knows what's up. <laughs> hmm. I know I already mentioned this earlier, but... In order to get out of here, it is essential that we all cooperate with each other. Is it? Is it, though? And the first step is this breakfast meeting. To allow us to become friends and build trust. Uh, what? So from now on, let's all meet here in the dining hall every morning after the morning announcement. What? Did I didn't agree to this. <laughs> now then, let's eat. Sure. <laughs> you want me to eat breakfast with other people? I've never done that b before. I'm not sure. Bruh. Togo, I mean, Matt, seriously? Yeah, it's been a while for me, too. Wait, what? But more important. Well, anyways, did anyone happen to come up with any clues? Yet. Yeah. Anybody? Sounds like go throughout the dining hall. <laughs> Nobody. Not at all. Seriously? Yeah, I know, right? Hey! hey Junko, don't get mad at me. I, I don't know what's going on. Anything. It, it could be about how to get out or who's doing this. Nobody is anything. Well, nothing's happened. So, Are you okay with this? You're going to die. What? <laughs> Thank you for telling me this. Huh? Huh? Do you understand? If you can't stop yourself from showing weakness in front of others, you will die. Well, thank you for being... Well, I would say honest, but you're an you're like the ultimate gambler. I can't trust you at all. <coughs> oh, sorry. I coughed on, on the mic. Stop here. it! Ugh. What the hell? Don't even freaking joke about that. My throat's been kind of scratchy. That's why I've been wondering so much. It's like, eh. That's why I've been coughing. It kind of sounds scratchy, but you know what? I'll make it work. <laughs> I'm not joking. Adaptability is survivability. Did I not say so? I mean, she does have a point there. Survival of the fittest, you know? So you'd better hurry up and adapt to your new life here. What the hell is this? Have you gone completely insane? Adapt to my new life here? 
You have any idea what you're saying? No, not really. What? Yeah, it sounds what? like the girl wants to live here. And hell, more power to her. But shit. Piece of shit! No way in hell am I living here. I'm getting out of here. I don't give a shit. Punch <laughs> walls, dude. Mm -hmm. Sure, feel free. Huh. Uh. Okay, so nobody has any clues. Yeah, so we're, we're just wasting our time. What the heck? One thing I can tell you is who's behind all this. Someone who's totally weird and messed up. Yeah, it's Mona Kuma, duh. I figured this out already. Why else would we be trapped here in the first place? Because. Hey, listen. I don't know. Well, sure, it could be something like that. But for right now, actual clues are. Uh, um. Um, wait. Shahira, who upset you? Uh, what happened? Uh, um, if you think in terms of people who are really abnormal or bizarre, you think maybe the personal person responsible for all this could be a certain murderous fiend? X. I gotta get. I gotta make sure my X. I gotta know my X button, my Y button here. A murderous fiend. Shahira, do you have some idea who might be behind all this? That's a good question. Give me a hint. Mm. Well, maybe. I mean, I can't really be certain, but... Oh, dear. Are we about to point fingers? Got it! Certainty is not a concern right now. It's 100% a concern. Get over yourself. I'll allow whatever you marks you may have. You know? Okay, well... Oh, wait. It is not a concern at all. You're right. I misread your comment. <laughs> have you guys heard of Genocide Jack? No. No, I haven't, actually. You mean that serial killer who, that's been in the news and all over the internet? What? What? <laughs> the monstrous villain who's murdered scores of victims in brutally bizarre fashion? Wait, what? <laughs> the word bloodlust was left at each murder scene, written in the victim's own blood. Oh. Oh my, this got dark quick. <laughs> Whoever it is, he's like a ghost. He strikes without warning and disappears without a trace. And on the internet, they started calling him hmm. Genocide Jack. That about covers it, I think. <sighs> they say he's claimed over a thousand victims. Oh dear. Uh. Hmm. That's just an urban legend, though, right? I mean, even like ten people would be totally insane. Yeah, true. Uh, hmm. Toko, why are you that worried? Anyway, whoever Genocide Jack really is, he's obviously some kind of super crazy killer. Huh? And if he's really this ultimate psycho, okay, enough with the ultimate word there. I wouldn't be surprised if he put together something like this. But. But like I said, I can't be certain. I don't have any evidence or anything. It's just a thought. Okay, the thought's in the air. Hey, hold on. But if they're the killer, isn't that like a killer of, of a problem for us? Ah, <laughs> nice. Yeah. It's okay. Everything's absolutely positively 100% without a doubt gonna be okay. You're right, it is. Cause help's gonna be here soon, I'm sure of it. I don't think anyone knows we're missing. <clears throat> huh, help? Yeah, you know, help, you know, the thing we're after. Cause, I mean. We've been stuck in here a few days already, right? Yeah. Nobody knows we're actually stuck here though. Nobody's been able to contact us, so I'm sure they're getting worried. I bet they called the police already, did they? Wait, what? What's this? The police? You're putting your faith in the police? Monokuma, please, go away. We're in the middle of a discussion here, sir. Bastard! What are you doing here? That is a good question. You guys. You guys, seriously. Do you understand what role the police exist to fill? Huh? Wait, what? All they're good for is being a foil, playing against a villain or anti-hero or evil organization. Is it just me, or is Monokuma getting topical? The bad guys come along and destroy them, and that shows just how badass they really are. <laughs> are you sure you want to rely on such an unreliable group of losers? Is your police force that bad? <laughs> yeah. I mean, come on. If you really, really want to get out of here, all you gotta do is kill. What? No. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, uh, hero, hero, hero. What the hell? Why the hell are you laughing? You know? I'm just depressed at the total commitment to this whole act. Um, are we sure it's an act at this point? I don't know, we're 10 episodes in. I'm not 100% sure it's an act. Come on. You're still going on? 
I think everyone else agrees. <laughs> You're still going on about that? You're fucking dead. So, Mr. Ki serial Killer Psycho Freak Bastard, what the hell do you want? Huh? Mr. Serial Killer Psycho Freak Bastard, huh? That's a pretty long name. German, maybe? Monokuma, you're an asshole. You know that? <laughs> hey, come on. We know who you really are. <sighs> maybe if I'll ignore if I ignore him, he'll just go away. <laughs> Monokuma is sassy AF. I like Monokuma. You son of a hey, bitch! Don't ignore me, asshole. Hmm. Okay, okay, let's get back to business. To defeat the Huns. You must kill. <laughs> Your life here has already begun, and a couple days have gone by, and nobody's killing anybody. I thought all you kids were lazy and selfish, and here you are working together. But I'm totally bored. There's nothing you can say that'll make us start killing each other. I got it. Wait, I think. Yes, ding ding ding. I figured it out. Wait, what'd you figure out? I'm I'm scared. In other words, all the mystery ingredients are here. Right people, right place. So why hasn't anyone killed anyone yet? That's why I couldn't understand. But I just realized there was one very important piece missing. Oh? Wait, what is this piece? W what are you... What piece? Shing! If you want to know, I'll tell you. It's motive. Motive? <laughs> <laughs> it's so simple. I just have to give everyone a motive. Hmm? Motive? Stop fucking around. Motive? What the fuck are you talking about? Hey, um... Oh, by the way, there's something I want to show you guys. You son of a bitch! Stop changing the subject! Yeah, stop changing the subject! Hmm... I have a little video I'd like you all to see. What? Video? Ooh, oh, but don't exciting. worry. It's not some pervy adult video or anything. Thank you, because I didn't want to get banned on YouTube. Silly Monokuma. Stashing away the porn for later. It's nothing like that. It's a special video for each of you showing what's going on outside the school. Wait. Greetings from outside the school? Outside the school? What are you talking about? Hello. <laughs> Ooh, Master's so impatient today. Oh my. Um. Oh my. <laughs> Why don't you just watch it and find out? Hmm. Here in the school, there's a, a specific place you can go that has everything you need to watch the video. Correct. Good, then we can go watch the video right now. Let's watch the video, yeah. But before we do that, I'd like to know. You. What are you? Why would you do something like this? I am your father. I'm sorry. What do you want from us? You killed! Hmm? We went over this. What do I want from you? Well, if you must know. Despair. That's all. Despair, huh? I got plenty of that. Well, now. If you want to know more of that, you'll have to figure it out for yourself. Do we really need a cutscene just for two words or three words? Hmm. Do whatever you need to do. Do whatever you need to to. Uh, I thought that was a typo. That's not a typo. Do you whatever you need to to uncover the mystery hidden within this school. I won't try and stop you. Do whatever you need to. Uh, I mean, actually, that could technically be a typo. I don't know. Thinking about it too hard. <laughs> Cause to be honest, it's entertaining as heck watching you guys search so desperately for answers. Yeah, you know, we're we're yeah, we're running out of time here. <laughs> so I guess I want amusement from you too. I want to feel happy. That's what I want. He's gone. And once again he left before we could find out anything useful. Well he's not gonna just give us the game, Sayaka. Is be that hard. right? Alright, Kyoko, what's up? Really? I think we learned something very useful. Oh? He has no intention of standing in the way of our pursuit of the truth. Interesting. Of course not. However... Perhaps. But what about the video he mentioned? I'm very curious to see what's on it. So am I. So That's am I. true. Same here. Okay, so... Mondo started glancing around the dining hall. When his gaze landed on me, he stopped. Oh. Are you about to knock me Are you about to tell me you, you like my cut, G? Hell yeah. Oh, okay. Hey, Mikado, check this out for us, would you? Wait. <laughs> huh? Why me? Yeah, why me? What did I do? Yo. Because you're closest to the door. That's the rule, right? Technically, Taka is close to the door, thank you. Rule? 34? Jesus Christ. Hey, hey. 
Hey, 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 hey. Piece of shit! Hey! Oh, oh, okay, fine, Mondo. Fine, Mondo. Stop I'll fucking check. around. You see how passionately I'm begging you? What's the big deal? Just check it. Yeah, sure. Okay. Okay, I'll get yeah, Hell let's go. yeah. <laughs> Thanks, I hope you won. Hey, um. Makoto's going, I'm going with him. It's not safe to walk around this place. Look. Yes, I can. Let's go. Yo. Yeah, sure thing. We're counting on the both of you. If anything happens, just yell and I'll come running. Will you? Um. I can't decide if Mundo's totally dependable or completely terrible. The answer to that question is yes. <laughs> yeah, I have to say he's kind of both. <laughs> See, Makoto agrees with me. I understand. He's not exactly a bad person. But I definitely can't say he's a good person either. Yeah, true. <sighs> so then, where's the specific place Monokuma mentioned? Good question. Must be somewhere you can watch DVDs, but... The place set up to watch DVDs? Um, if it's a place set up to watch DVDs, then... Uh, let's see. If I can remember correctly, it's... Is it here? It's the store. Wait, that's the laundromat. Laundromat doesn't have DVDs. Uh, let me check the map. Um, would it be on the second floor, maybe? No, because then it's blocked off. Um, is it the trash can? <laughs> Definitely the trash can. Wait, what's this door here? Oh, that's the bathroom. Oh, is that the bathroom? Really? Wait, what's this door? Oh, this just leads back to the, um, what's this? Is this the waste facility? That's where all the DVDs go in the trash. Okay, uh. Wait. Where exactly am I going? That's the second floor. It's blocked off. Um, uh, that's the bathhouse. That's locked off. Uh, let's try the laundromat, I guess. Um, um yeah. Specific, we need to go. Okay. Um, not back in the dining hall. Back in our bedroom. <laughs> Let's watch the thing in the bedroom. Oh, oh dear. Uh, is it here? Door won't budge. It must be locked. Yeah, that makes sense. I can't go upstairs. Can't watch it in the laundromat. The bathroom house is out of commission. Uh, in the bathroom maybe. Okay. Oh, that's the map. Uh. It's like the places I need to go are blocked off. Okay, it's beat up run, by the way. Hifumi's room, maybe? Okay, no. Not in the bedrooms. Huh. The lag, though. Oh, wait, there's. Oh, no, we're back here again. Um. I can't go this way. Let's check the map again. That just leads that way. Uh, that leads out. I'm trying to look. It's really not much outside of, because I only have access to the first floor. Let's try here. Um. No. I know there's a certain place I need to go, but really not much in the way of places I can go. Oh, I can't tell if that's the map lagging for me or the, uh, or the game itself. I'm watching here. Oh, yeah, that is the way out, isn't it? Okay. Uh, maybe it's the big old, like, hallway with the, the AV room? Is this an AV room? Oh, that is an AV room. Oh, okay. Uh huh. Let's see. Let's see what I can explore. Okay, this and this. Okay, the box. Let's see what's in the box. There's something inside this cardboard box. It's a bunch of DVDs. There's a lot of them actually. Each one has a label on it with someone's name. This must be the video for each of us. He mentioned. Oh. Uh, hold okay, on cool. a second. Better go tell everyone. Okay, bye, Sayaka. Just ran off. 
I didn't follow after her. I just stood right there where I was. Oh. The DVDs in front of me had robbed me of all awareness. I was rooted in place. Let me view it. I think I see something. Uh, the box. Okay. What else can I explore? Oh, there's... There's a control room. There's a TV. Let's see what the TV has. Kind of monitored. Okay. Has Monokuma Co. written across it. I guess they covered all the details. Okay, so Monokuma has his own monitor now. What's in this DVD? Next to the monitor is high-end DVD player. It'll probably play those DVDs, no problem. Maybe I'll just watch mine real quick before everyone else gets here. Yeah, let's watch mine. So we're through the DVDs I found in the box and found the one with my name on it. Then I slid it into the expensive looking player and it broke. Oh, I sat down and stared intently at the darkened screen. And then... I yelled out without realizing it, and my heart started racing. Oh, is that his family? Wow, they're actually kind of cool. Because what I saw on that monitor, it was my family. You getting picked to attend Hope's Peak Academy is like a dream come true. Make sure you do your best. I'm so proud of you, son. But remember, don't push yourself too hard. Are you really watching this, Makoto? Good luck, okay? If it had ended there, that would have been fine. A message of love and support. Wait, what do you mean, the end? That's not the end? After leaving my family behind to attempt to attend Hope's Peak, it would have given me hope, given me strength. If this was a normal school, I would have been happy, if a little embarrassed. With my family's support to rely on, I would have been motivated to do even better. But here, now, it was totally different. I wasn't living an ordinary school life. So I had a pretty strong feeling that the video wasn't going to end there. I hated having that feeling, but it turned out I was absolutely right. What the f- <laughs> This time, I couldn't even make a sound. Oh, oh my, uh... My voice just died. And it looks like so did everybody else. What the hell? Where'd everyone go? It looks like a war zone or something. As if in reply, a voice came floating out of the speakers. I recognized the voice, of course. It was... Him. Makoto Naegi accepted into Hope Speak Academy and his family who supported such a lucky boy. But it seems like something's happened to this family's well-being. Oh boy, this is bad. What could have possibly happened to this family's well-being? Look for the answer after graduation. Wait, what? What is this? What happened to everyone? I started trembling. I could feel the fear and anger building up inside me like hot magma. I slammed my fist against the desk over and over again. A single thought was racing through my mind. What else? How could I think about anything else? I have to get out of here. I have to get out right now. I need to make sure everyone's safe. Makoto? Wait, what? Um, We're running long on time, by the way. I just realized that. What happened? Make sure who's safe. Everyone. I noticed everyone standing around the entrance to the, the AV room. They stared at me, faces full of confusion. Um. What's going on? That is a good question. What is going on? I'm confused. Without a word, I pointed to the cardboard box. Is it like... Is that what Monokuma was talking about? Yeah, basically. What does this mean? What's on them? Uh, why'd you disappear, sir? They all gathered around the box, and each of them grabbed the DVD with their name on it. One by one, they each rushed to a monitor. It didn't take long for them to react. What the? What the fuck? Huh? This can't be real, right? It has to be fake, right? 
Hey, hold on. Yeah, no way it's real. <laughs> no way. <laughs> I can't take it anymore. <laughs> can't take this anymore. Let me out of here. As soon as I saw their reactions, I knew. They'd all seen something like what I had seen. Nobody even bothered trying to hide their fear and confusion. Except for her. Let me guess, Kyoko? Even now, she was totally calm. I see. Yep, Kyoko. I see. <laughs> so this is what he meant by motive. Why am I not surprised it was Kyoko? He wants to fuel our desire to leave so that we're more likely to start killing each other. Kyoko knows everything. Yes, indeed. It is the classic prisoner's dilemma. Hmm? Huh? Yeah, you should know about this. Hmm. Let me use an example. Imagine two countries are at the brink of war. Uh, on the brink of war, excuse me. But both countries want peace, and each commits to scaling back their forces as a sign of good faith. But there's a chance that one country may betray the other, so each country fears lowering their guard. The result is that neither scales back their forces and they both end up betraying each other. Makes sense. Do you understand? In other words, the fear of invisible treachery becomes the greatest enemy of stability. Long story short, <laughs> trust. And it's a thing. That kind of sounds like us right now. Everyone says they'll work together, but in our hearts we're all afraid someone might betray us. Makes sense. <laughs> Don't put those awful thoughts in our head. That's exactly what they want us to do. Yeah, basically. Huh? You could say that, but maybe you're thinking that once everyone drops that guard, you can just... What? Oh, what oh dear. is this? Everyone's, everyone's getting a little antsy. What? Hey. This is exactly what Monokuma or whoever's behind this wants. They want us to fight, don't you see? Yeah, you're right. We all need to come to Chihiro's right, as is Sakura. I love them both. They are awesome. So then. Okay, then. Maybe we should start all by, by all just talking. Yeah, it makes sense. Maybe if we all just the Hulk talk about what we saw, that'll help get everything out of our system. Hmm. Besides, I think we're all super curious, right? I wonder what was in everyone's videos. That's a good question. I wonder too. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't curious. Hey, Sayaka. Oh, she lifeless in this one. Oh crap. What was in your video, Sayaka? Uh. Oh dear. Um. What's your problem? What's wrong? Just hurry up and tell us. Wow, Toko, chill. Oh, oh dear. Um, I'd be scared like that too. Sayaka. I gently placed my hand on her shoulder. Ah! Oh, t oh, okay. I whoop. Stop it. She pushed my hand away and suddenly ran off. Oh. Huh? D Sayaka. That's enough. Let her go. Yeah, might as well. I can't do that. I must know. I have to go make sure she's okay. Yeah, let's let's leave. <laughs> I hate romantic comedies like this. I don't care what happens to her personally. Toko, I have several questions about you, ma'am. What? That's because you're totally thoughtless. Yeah, basically. You're right, Jungo. Um. I'm really worried. Me too. Me too. I'm trying to end the episode. <laughs> Holy crap! Then why don't you go do whatever you think is you have to? We all we don't all have to stick around together, right? I hope you are well. Speaking of which. I have my own little things to take care of. Goodbye. I'm out. Peace. <laughs> Everyone went their separate ways. But I don't have time to worry about them right now. I have to go find Sayaka. I'm going to do that in the next episode. Because this episode's running a little long. So next time on Dang and Rumpa, we're going to find out what's up with Sayaka. And go from there. Till then, Hedgy out. Bye-o. Uh, what the heck? <laughs> uh.